Hi guys, I hope you're well and welcome back. Today I'm going to show you my volume hair routine. This is a video on how to turn fine, limp, lifeless hair like this into dreamy, volume filled hair like this. I am working with Paul Mitchell on this video, but I have tried and tested every single product and I'm so excited to be telling you guys about them. Let me tell you, if you have volume problems in your life, you won't have any more after watching this video. So without further ado, because I can't actually stop touching my do, here is how I got the do. So the first step is washing my hair, obviously. I have tried countless amounts of shampoos. I do kind of flip between a few different ones, but at the moment I have settled quite nicely on the Paul Mitchell Extra Body Shampoo and the Conditioner, which is called the Daily Rinse. And these products are really nice, they smell really nice as well, but not only that, I do find that they give me volume. I find that it can be really, really difficult to get volume and body from a shampoo, but I find with these, they work exceptionally well. And my little tip for this shampoo especially is to wash your hair twice. I find that it just gives a little bit more volume to my hair and my hair feels super, super clean as well. So as you can see, my hair is up in a towel and I actually like to leave my hair up in a towel for quite a while because I hate styling my hair when it's soaking wet. I actually prefer when it's kind of like this, it's still wet but it's more on the damp side and I find that that's when I get the most volume. So now that I have brushed through my hair and got rid of all the knots, I'm going to pop in some of my Thicken Up Styling Liquid. As soon as I use this and dry my hair, I feel like my fine hair feels a lot thicker, it looks thicker, and I just feel a little bit more confident about my hair in general. So depending on how much hair you've got, I tend to use two to three pumps of this on mine. You want to just put this in the palms of your hand, rub it through, and then just gently kind of massage this into your hair. Do this from the mid lengths to the ends. You don't want to be putting this on the root because we have a root lift product that we'll be using instead. So next up, I'm actually gonna use a root lift product. And this one is the Extra Body Daily Boost. And you spray this on the roots, which means that you get that really good root lift. I don't use this every time I do my hair, but if I'm going somewhere special or I want a certain amount of root lift, I will use this because it gives you an amazing amount of body. What you wanna do with this is you want to take off the little cap and just spray it as close to the root and the scalp as possible. I like to just lift up pieces of hair, give it a spray, and then move on to the next section. I wouldn't advise spraying loads and loads in your hair only where you need the volume most. So I just concentrate mostly at the top and at the sides of my hair. Only that is paraben and gluten free, it's vegan and it's color safe, so it's even better. Now that I've got all the product in my hair, I'm just gonna give it a blast with the hair dryer. To do this, I like to flip my head upside down and just completely blast the air on the roots and the ends. So blow drying your hair upside down is the best way to maximize that root lift. And as you can see, there is so much volume in my hair. It's massive, like look. <laughs> so even though I would love to leave the house with my hair like this, I always have to style it. So before I do that, I'm obviously gonna use some heat protect. And this one is my favorite, favorite heat protect idea in the world. This is basically a heat protect hairspray. You just literally spray this through your hair before you curl it. It has a heat protect element to it, but also a hairspray element to it. That's basically what I've been, I mean, I, I wish I'd invented this first because let's face it, they beat me to it. I just like to give the can a bit of a shake and then just spray over my hair. Plus it smells really nice, kind of like berries, which I'm all for the berries. <laughs> so I'm gonna split my hair into two and as you can see, I've already put my hair in the middle part in just for this step. And then I'm grabbing my straighteners. These are actually by Paul Mitchell as well. They're the Neuro straighteners. They got up to 230 degrees, which is what I've got them on. But obviously you can put that down a bit if your hair is more susceptible to curling. But mine is stubborn, so it has to go right up. And this is just basically about the end. I'm not gonna touch the top. So I'm just gonna go halfway through and then just give the tongue a twist like so and pull it through my hair very slowly and gently twisting as you go and as you can see it just gives a little bit of texture and a bit of a wave just to the end which is what I've been I've just been loving wearing my hair like this recently so I'm just going to carry that on all the way through my hair again if you've got long hair this would work you just have to obviously go for a lot longer when it comes to the pulling the curl through so now that I've carried my hair the last step that I like to do to get loads of volume before I kind of loosen out these curls is change my parting. So I'm actually gonna just use my hand to kind of take this section over like so 
And if you do like your parted to be super, super straight, you can obviously use a comb, but I actually quite like having it a little bit messy. I like that kind of look. And as you can see instantly, just moving that front section over after we've curled it and kind of dried it that way, it just adds that extra bit of volume. So lastly, I'm gonna pop on some of this finishing spray and this is really good for volume and shine. I'm just gonna spray this over the curls mostly just to make sure they stay put. But also I'm going to lift up and spray under the roots as well, just to make sure that that root lift cannot go anywhere. <laughs> This will stay put in a blizzard. <laughs> so I'm just gonna mess around with it a little bit, make sure everything's looking exactly how I want it to. Just brush through those curls a little bit. So guys, that was my volume hair routine video. As you can see, it definitely, definitely works. And I absolutely love this routine. I love it for nights out, but I also love it for days like today, when now I hope that the postman will knock on my door because look at my do. <laughs> if you're interested in any of the products I've used in today's video, I will of course leave all of the links, the names and the prices down below so you can go and shop those and read more information about them as well. So obviously I'd love to say a very big thank you to you guys for watching, but also Paul Mitchell for working with me on this video and allowing me to introduce you guys to a lovely, lovely brand with such great values as well. Like I mentioned, all of their products are cruelty free, they're vegan, and they have been the entire time. They've never tested on any animals, which I absolutely love. Not only that, they're paraben free and they're also color safe, which means they're great for everyone. And as you guys obviously know, I love my affordable items, especially when it comes to clothing, but this is no different to when it comes to hair, except the fact that I find it's very, very difficult to find affordable hair items that work. I think this video is proof enough between the before and after that these items do work and every product I used in this video was below £20, which just proves that affordable, luxury, professional salon products are just as good as ones that cost a fortune too. So that's all for now. I'm gonna go now and show off my new do and never wash my hair ever again. I'm also gonna take about 20 million selfies, so you can expect those on my Instagram. <laughs> Have a lovely day, guys, and I'll see you again very soon. Bye. Mwah.